for you tonight. The FDA says there's too many unknowns about CBD products to regulate them as food or supplements, but that could change in the future. WCI 3's Chance Stickland joins us live from the newsroom. Chance, how would new regulations affect businesses in central Illinois? Jessica, one manager says his shop is being patient until they get more information. Another shop says the announcement is encouraging. The FDA is taking a look at CBD after advocates and lawmakers started asking for the chemicals to be allowed in food and supplements. It's definitely something to think about. That's Taylor Jones, manager at Five Star Nutrition in Champaign. They sell CPD oil. Jones says an FDA decision on CPD won't change their business model, but they're curious to see how it all plays out. FDA Commissioner Dr. Janet Woodcock said this week there is not enough evidence about CPD to confirm it's safe to consume or use as a dietary supplement. Jones says his customers use it for many reasons. Are taking it for like help with sleeping, body aches, or just overall relaxation? Jones says it only really started gaining popularity in the past five years. The FDA oversees it because it's the active ingredient in the prescription drug Epidiolex. It's used to treat two rare seizure disorders. Under current FDA regulations, a drug can't be added to food or sold as a dietary supplement if it hasn't been deemed safe. Jonah Rapino, a spokesperson for New Era, says he's open-minded to see what the FDA has to say. He says their decision will help determine the direction of the industry. And I think for the CBD only industry, I think that it's only going to be of benefit to them and to the consumers that there are people who are actually looking at how they're making this stuff. The FDA could decide to come down with new rules that require clear labels, limits on CBD levels, and a possible minimum purchase age. Jones says while his customers see the benefits, only time will tell if that expands to others. As time goes on, you're going to see overall like just different studies with it, you know, people using it more and more. The FDA also says regulations are needed for CBD products for animals. Reporting live in the newsroom, I'm Chance Sicklin, WCI3, your local news leader. Jess, back to you. Chance, thank you.